USC, a sweep over Arizona, consecutive sweeps for the women of Troy as they swept Oregon State last week as well. I'm Anne Marie Anderson, and let's take a look at the way they did it. First of all, USC with tremendous service pressure. They had 10 aces, five errors. That's an incredible percentage. You'd be happy, very happy with one for one, much less to have two to one. The service pressure kept Arizona out of their offense much of the night, and as a result, they only were siding out at around 40% for the match. Meanwhile, Brooke Bodkin, the super senior, delivers yet again. No errors at all on her attacking. 13 kills on 22 swings to hit 591. She's just an absolutely terminal hitter and incredibly dependable. She's in her last week of Pac-12 play after a five-year career. Meanwhile, Kaylin O's the other pin. When you can get both your pins hitting double figures in terms of kills, you've really got a great offense going. And so for Kaylin O's with 11 kills hitting 350 today, just unloading. Very powerful hitter. You see her here out of system as well. So important to keep yourself open. But to have three pins in double figures, well, they had their opposite, Amelia Vesca as well. She had four service aces on the day. And Vesca, Vesca with 10 kills, hitting 381. So those are all incredible percentages and shows you how much was going right for USC today. They passed very well, a side out percentage of 71% for the match, a great hitting percentage as well. And so for USC, a really important win, back to back sweeps by the women of Troy. They have Arizona State coming in here on Sunday. Will they be able to sweep the weekend? We'll find out. So long from the Galen Center, Arizona needs to recoup and play UCLA on Sunday.